Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a cool car revealing effect using a CC ball action easy in After Effects, let's begin. To make that effect, first we will need to mask the car and then remove the car from a background. For a smooth masking and tracking, I will use Mocha AE. In Mocha let's select a pen tool and mask the car like that. Once you are done, enable perspective and click on tracking forward button, as the tracking is done, click on save and then close Mocha. Now expand mat and click on create AE masks. Now make sure to press M on a keyboard and change mask mode to subtract. Now go to content aware fill and click on create reference frame to open Photoshop. In a Photoshop select a remove tool and remove that spot here. Once you are done, go to file and click on save, then we can close Photoshop and go back to AE. Under a content aware fill, copy my settings and click on generate fill layer, then just wait until analyzing and rendering is done. Once it's done and the car is removed from a background, I will rename my layer to clean. Then duplicate it and move duplicated one above fill layer, now rename it to car only and then press M on a keyboard and delete the mask. Also delete Mocha AE effect. Now we have to isolate the car from a background, so make sure that the car only layer is selected and then grab a roto brush tool and double click on car only layer. Rotoscope the car as smooth as possible now. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, close rotoscoping window and make sure to pre-compose car only layer. I will correct the name and then make sure that the move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then hit OK. On a car only layer apply CC ball action effect. Change grid spacing to zero. Now make sure you are at the beginning of a car only layer and then click on ball size, displace and rotation stopwatch icons. Now change displace to around negative 200. Change rotation to around negative 20. Now scroll to the end and change rotation and displace both to zero. Scroll back to the beginning and change ball size to zero. Then scroll in the middle and change ball size back to 100. Let's quickly check the effect. Looks fine, but now press U on a keyboard and then select all keyframes and press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them. Now go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph. Now make sure none of those keyframes are selected and then select only rotation and displace and then make a smooth curve like this. Let's check it again. And we are done. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.